Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Trick. And today's video is going to be a little bit different. It might not be that useful for too many people, but it could be. So I've had a, a new customers asking me to engrave um, just a heart on the shape of Texas. So I took a picture of his cutting board, laid it on the floor, made sure I got... Um, I'm just kind of playing with this right now. Um, made sure I got a, a good, you know, picture on top of the board, you know, so it wouldn't be at one side. And then I measured his board and it was, uh, I drew a box right here and it was 15 point, 15 and an eighth wide. So this is why I found to draw a box first. Then you know that box is that certain size. And then you can take your photograph and scale it down till you get to that box size. That way you don't have to stop and keep measuring with the parallel dimension tool. So once you get, and I'm a little bit off from really what I'm going to do with it, but so I've got the size and then I'm just going to double check and I'm going to take the parallel dimension tool and I'm going to go from that corner to that corner that a diagonal. I measured it. It was, you know, by my tape, it was 15 and three quarters. So 15.71, we're close enough. So I've, my picture is correct. Now you can take a map of your state, Texas or whatever state you live in, but you can't see it, you know, on top of the picture. So what I did, I, I already had a shape of Texas. So I just took the shape of Texas and I made my map that shape, that size, to fit, and then I put a, a black dot where Texas is. I grouped them back together. I grouped them both together, and then I put it back in my shape. So now I know that Austin, and the customer actually wanted in the center of this piece of wood. You know, he, and he wants me to put a heart there. Anyway, so there's two ways you could run this on the laser, and one of them would be kind of difficult because you could draw a square box and and because all you're going to do is etch one little heart. But the way I'm going to do it, I think, when I do it this afternoon, I'm going to lay this edge against the laser to make sure I'm square with the bed. And I might even do a couple things uh, with my new Fusion 40. I could actually jog, you know, set my red dot pointer, and I could actually jog down this strip so I know I'm parallel and, and not cockeyed. But then to run the job, I'm just going to measure down 2.31 inches from the top of this part of the board down and then put it, you know, draw a line with pencil or whatever, and then put, put the heart right there in the center of this board and, and then run it, engrave it, uh, clean it up for him and, and be done. You know, the, there's other things you could do this with. I'm not just saying, you know, the state of Texas or any of your state, but anything that you need to precisely put something in a spot that's, you know, geographically done. And, I, and I'm guessing the states would probably be the only thing. But, you know, there's somebody who might have brought you a picture in, of something they want to X on the spot where well, you could take a picture of the box or whatever. And you could put an X right where they want the X. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. And thank you for watching.